For purchases which aren't charged right away, such as grocery pickup, weekly meal kit services, or online orders that don't process until the order ships, you can use the pre-authorized option from within your spending cube. Pre-authorizing holds or earmarks funds from the spend cube of your choice, and then allows a merchant to charge the amount later without the need to open a cube. Here's how it works. When you're on the checkout page for your merchant and know the exact amount of the order, swipe left on the spend cube you want to use for the payment and tap spend to open the spend menu. Select pre-authorize and enter the transaction amount with a number that exactly matches the price of your purchase, according to its checkout page. It is important the entered amount is an exact match to what the merchant will be charging. If it isn't an exact match, the charge will be declined. You may also add a note if you'd like. Once you're done, tap Authorize Purchase Amount. Once you authorize the amount, funds will be held with a pre-auth tag and can be seen in the activity screen. In the event you end up canceling the actual order, you can release the held earmark funds by canceling the pre-authorization. Another option for online merchants that don't charge your card right away is to create a virtual bill cube and use your unique virtual card or account number for these purchases.